Okay, we have also talked about this where I need it. There we go, that's a little bit better. We have talked quite a bit about the Half Moon comb by Utsumi. And people are always asking me why it's such a good comb. Well, let me show you why. I can comb through him with this comb. And he looks pretty fluffed. And it stays pretty much where I want it and all of that good stuff. It's a little bit big for him, but if I take this comb, I want you to notice it's catching hair that that one didn't catch. It's catching it. It's separating it. Stop. Notice how fluffed and how smooth that looks from here. When I use it on his face, Oh, we need to trim that, don't we, buddy? We missed that hair. Let me fix that real quick while I'm thinking about it. I always keep a pair of scissors, even if they're not the best scissors. And a clipper in here at the drawing table, just for stuff like that. Okay. I feel better. But anyhow, when you take this comb, and notice, my, this comb found that. My other comb didn't. And comb through. It's catching more hair. It's finding tangles that the other combs didn't find. And notice how much better of a fluff I just got with that comb. Now he wears a tie up. And I'm not going to spend a lot of time trying to make it perfect because I take it down just about every day and put it back in. It's amazing to me that I actually like my little boy poodle looking like this when I was so adamant that he was going to look like a poodle till the day he died. Well, one picture in a um, Japanese magazine did me in. <laughs> I saw a picture of a dog groomed similarly to this one and I knew I was going to groom him this way and it has worked really well. He went from a continental to this. But again, notice how fluffed and how straight and just how wonderfully smooth that comb made that look. And again, it found stuff that the other comb didn't find. Because the teeth are so small in here, working under eyes is easy. You don't have to worry about it. You don't have to worry about grabbing them in the face. You don't have to worry about anything. I use it on legs as well. And again, look how well it fluffs. It just, the hair just stands out beautifully when you, when you use this. And again, it finds knots that my brush and my comb didn't find. So yes, the $80 comb, worth every penny. How did you get your head all twisted up? There you go. Look at the camera one more time. Look right there. He says, I don't like this, Mama. But again, you can see how well it works. Good boy. <laughs>